All right, back in Fallout New Vegas, Mr. Perfect. Yes, last episode we were at Camp McCarran, I believe. I did come over here because I finally, after hours of messing around with tick fix, fixed the stutter problem. Watch this. I don't get the hard stutter anymore. Issue is resolved, I think. Because usually does it stutter right here. And if I come this way, I also changed my running animations to just mods instead of solid project. But look at that. It is running flawlessly. Alright, with all that being said, how close are we to leveling up? Because I want to change... Actually, pretty close. I might... If I can. Can I? You know what? Let's see. It's been three days, right? I don't think so. I don't know. Springfield. I have. I want to take a look at this Springfield weapon. I think it's one of those like 1800 weapons. Yeah, I don't. I don't think that's what it's supposed to do. <laughs> Alright, that's a mod we can get rid of in my 2.0 version of this mod list. In fact, I'm going to write that down. All mod lists are a work in progress. I'll get rid of that one and replace it with another weapon mod. Alright. Now we don't, of course, we're not going to change anything while we're playing the game. so much ammo. I don't I have so much ammo I'm never going to use. Uh, where are we going? We do have some bounties. We, we have Cyrus Graham, which is pretty close to here, actually. Let's go after him, and then we also have New Vegas bounties, which is really close to here as well. So we can kill two birds one stone. And go ahead and get these bounties real quick. One for Randall, one for the NCR. Look at that. Flawlessly smooth. Yeah, yeah. I'm currently working on 2.0 version of this mod list, so. I'll remove some mods. Uh, Eve, EVE, Bleed. And I swapped it for Bleed List. I got rid of Metro style difficulty and replaced it with a script runner version, ESP list version. And I got rid of perk every level and replaced it with a script runner version. That way I can free up some ESP slots. I also updated my UI. I like the classic UI, I really do. Actually, I think I like this UI. It just, I really like, for some reason, I like the aesthetic of the classic Fallout, but I never can actually play it. If only it were like this. Uh, okay, you're an NCR hey. trooper. Just standing out here. Name's Corporal Joan Barry. You're up to that Cyrus guy, too. No, I'm not. I see. I've been going after him, but there's nothing in here. Guess I have to go back to my cabin empty-handed. Stay safe, traveler. If I pickpocket you, 
He has a detonator. Which is... Suspicious. Now remember, Mr. Perfect has 10 intelligence. What do you think you're doing? I knew it. However, the detonator would come in handy. I need to figure out... I know I've been saying that for episodes. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna figure out a way to get rid of that. I wonder if it's steam overlay. See, I'm fine with the little... The, the little micro. Like, the little... Yeah, I'm fine with that. It's the hard stutter that was getting me. That is gone. I just... I can't get over it. Finally. Civilizing premise. Oh, what am I doing? Let's take a look at New Vegas bounties now. And we're really thirsty. And we're hungry? Okay, yeah, New Vegas Bounties LE makes it so it's here. In the original New Vegas Bounties, it was on, the hollow tape was on the ground here. And nine times out of ten, it would work. But that one time, it would actually, you know, fall through the ground and you couldn't get it. You have to, you either had to get lucky using TCL or use the console to surpass this part if you know how to use the console and do all that but you scan the bloodstained pages of Quantrill's diary it's a crude account of countless raids scavenging missions and skirmishes that span several decades in the final log the final log mentions his spirit officer Onada and for him he mentions their intent to assault the brother was still safe as his means to acquire weaponry. Probably Enclave. Oh, those are definitely fiends. What I'm gonna do the next time I get to level a five, I, I'm really gonna get. Uh, I need to get the self spotter perk. But I want to get the uh, the cloak perk too. I also want to get I also want to get faster faster. Uh, both of those There's so much stuff to get. But there's so many levels. I mostly want the cloaking thing so I don't have to use this armor. It's a good armor, it's just that, you know, it's some of the meshes here kind of like are messed up. And I don't know how to fix that myself. Remember, this character can take drugs. We just haven't had a need to. And we also went back to Desert Natural Weathers in the last one. And, uh, and the new updated version of this mod list. I think those are friendly. Oh, look at that Deathclaw Valley up here. Yep, 
Now they don't even. Oh, they spotted me. Like, I'm pretty sure I had the perk that makes me undetected when I sneak. Again, I might just take strong back. That's an extra 25. When can I get Wasteland Donkey? I think it's level 30. Once I get Wasteland Donkey, I don't need to worry about carry weight anymore. And my... Yep. My HP is recovering. Thanks to the subdermal implant. No, 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 the, the mono, monocycle breeder. What is this? Is this Raul Shack? Yeah. Oh, wait, let me go ahead and... Discover this manhole if I haven't already. That's the only thing about the animations, man. The, when you get these perks for faster reloading, you, you miss out on the awesome animations, but that's alright. Alright, we're going into uncharted territory. We haven't been over here on, yet. I don't see anything. Now I wonder if I get the B42 wristwatch. Will that cover up my hand part right there? If I just get it for looks. Yeah, I'm, I should be able to Get close enough here and believe it or not. actually ambient inclusion what's going on I, I switch back to nut EMB oh look at that veteran armor I want it all you need is one ranger protecting the monorail you don't even need to feed him that much he'll get it done 
I'm like, can I, can I get that armor? That is a unique veteran armor. They just, oh, there's death claws around here. Death claws take more than a few shots, even with critical. Let's just make it back to Roll Shack and hopefully. Should I see what this is? Train tunnel. Very hard. I, I can pick it. Didn't I just drink water? Then again, I guess it has been hours in the game. Right, let's see if I can make it back to Freeside, East Gate, or North Gate, whatever it's going to take me to. Call into the manhole. Ooh, I can go to Camp McCarran. Turn this bounty in. And then get the truck and head to Prim. Or I can get the truck, head to Camp McCarran, and then go to Prim with the truck. Either way is valid. I'll probably just grab the truck. All right, it's night time. Once you're done buying overpriced birdshot, head on down to the Silver Rush for some real weaponry. All right. Camp McCarran it is. pushing forward. Did I put the Springfield in here? Because I need to. I'm going to sell that. Same and all, but Bethesda, the Bethesda engine and lighting. You. Hello. Hey. From the truck, it should be. Come on, I know where this is. What am I doing? Why am I lost? Oh, man, it should be right here. One more. Right on. It should be. There you are. First recon to camp forlorn hope. Now we got it. Yes, I'm listening. I killed Cyrus. Here's your proof. Well done. Here's your cash. Got any more work? I do. Your next target is Okid. Drug dealer responsible for increasing the amount of cans that make those feed junkies so hard to kill. We thought that the cans will take care of him, but nothing like that happened. He must have some sort of connections with them. Either way, we want him and his men out of the picture. I'll make here is the location on your map. Body base 500 caps. Dismissed. Thank you. Another one. Okay, in this case, we'll get survival. 
to 100. And then next we're working on science for specific reasons so I can get one perk. Better criticals. For every 20 points of skill group. That is a god tier perk. Especially with limit, li limitless uh, stats. I mean, that is kind of ridiculous. Uh, I'm looking for cloaking sneak. I don't know if I want cloaking stealth, but cloaking sneak sounds better. Cloaking stealth makes it to where I'm invisible all times when sneaking, but cloaking sneak just when I'm standing still. I mean, if I want one or the other, I can take one off and put the other on or have both on at the same time. Chance to hold it. We won't go quietly. The Legion can count. All right. Where are we going for this? Oh, we're going to Randall. So, where, where, how far is? We can go to West Side and handle that real quick. Well, you know what? We'll go to Prim. For, we'll, we'll turn. We'll turn this in because I don't know where the next bounty Randall's gonna take me. I'm sure it's not gonna be close. Okay. I wonder if the Bison Steve is a... We won't go quietly. The Legion can count on that. What are you doing here? This is our casino, punk. Are you deserters? I like to think that we're prisoners of war that managed to escape before capture. I don't know how long it'll be before the Legion crosses the river, but sure as fuck I don't want to be wearing an NCR uniform when they get here. Yeah, Prim has login. Fuck. We lose again. We heard Prim was ripe for the picking, so figured we could come here and shake down some of the suckers. We weren't expecting a sheriff here. We're just trying to put as many miles from NCR as we can. We don't want to be anywhere near New Vegas when the Legion crosses the river. So that's it. You resorted to robbing and raiding to solve your problems? Uh, okay, it doesn't sound like things. It sounds like that. It doesn't sound like things. Yeah, it doesn't sound like things have gone to plan. Our luck has gone south since we lost all of our money gambling in Vegas. Well, that's your fault. We didn't go AWOL from duty to become raiders. I can relate, but that's But your we've fault. seen what the Legion does to people that survive their battles. We wanted to be gone before the fighting starts. And we heard there may be some safety up in New Canaan. Yep, looks like you're totally screwed then. I'm getting tired of your chatter. Hand over a hundred caps, or we start using you for target practice. Okay. I was gonna, you know, not kill you guys, but... So be it. Perhaps your corpse will be better at coughing up the caps. Hey! Ah! 
Hey, they threatened me, so. That's completely on them. So can this place be used as a casino? I could have sworn this place could be used as a casino. Maybe you have to do the new Bison Steve Hotel mission for it to work. Move along, please. I came here to check and see. We'll do that new Bison stuff later. Almost makes me want to get performance of the guys again. To remove stuff like this. Not that I need it. I mean, my, to get over 100 FPS. But stuff like that, I just, you know, kind of useless. I'm pretty sure it wouldn't do much on my system. Can you believe while playing Primitive once? On my own, I died right here. I, I used my truck to get the Prim. And because I didn't come to Prim the normal way, I never got rid of the frag mines here. And I just ran over here willy-nilly, boom, exploited, died. And I'm like, how does a veteran player of New Vegas make a, a mistake like that? Like, I know the frag mines are there. How does that happen? Someone explain to me how that happens. Randall. Hey there. Is the convoy attacker dead? Yep. Good. Here's your reward. Don't spend it all in one place. Come back when you're ready for the next job. Someone is always in need of killing. You ready for another job? Yeah. That's what I like to hear. Our client is offering 1,000 caps for this next target, and after hearing about her misdeeds, I understand why. The bounty is on a fiend named Eileen. She's a vicious twat with a reputation for castrating male victims and consuming their flesh. Suffice to say, her activities are detrimental to troop morale. The payout is big on this one, so bury that sick bitch and head back. I just can't believe we're still alive. Now, if we do die, we get locked out of the save and I can't use it anymore. And then that'll be the end of this series. Like, if this series lasts forever, I mean, there's a lot of quest mods I can do. And then DLCs. And after that, at, the, at that point, and if I'm still alive, that's when you start adding stuff to the, to the game. I need the, and at that point, you know, it's like, it doesn't really matter. You just add, I don't add stuff like that, you know, but at that point, if I'm that far where I've done literally everything and the only way to keep going is if you add stuff, that's the only way that would happen. But man, well, at that point, I don't know. I mean, what, I guess I haven't done, in terms of quest mods, I haven't done Autumn Leaves before. I haven't done special delivery before. I haven't done... Well, I'll, I'll just have to find some stuff. Uh... Wait, I took a... Uh... Necessarily need this armor anymore. Okay. 
Um. That's only damage threshold at six. Revenant armor, health regeneration, 20 damage threshold. But this was a six fit for a while. That's what six wore for a while, so I don't want to do that. We gotta get something that'll fit this character. So for right now, I guess it is the bounty stuff armor until I find some combat armor. No. Until I find some sneaky armor. We'll keep that on. Oh, right, Miguel's bomb shot. They make more shops like this for attack to pack and classic fallout weapons. Nine hundred thirty feet from here. That's for Eileen, though. Is it? No, that's for Eileen. Is Two thousand feet from here. By the time I get to whoever these guys are, I would have like halfway made it to Eileen, so I might as well. We're gonna have to get some more AP. Taking the action less perk, less AP, fast regeneration. Okay. I could use cloaking whenever I'm not standing still as well. Gatekeeper. He ignores you. I'm Mr. Perfect. Let me in. Okay. Well. Asked nicely. I asked nicely. I asked very nicely. Not hitting. Uh -huh. I did 
that not hit. That's what I want to know. Got your head. So I'll take some of this blue. Unique type jet. Don't mind if I do. Probably end up never using it, but I'm surprised the cons weren't on this. Alright, we're gonna go after Eileen. Too far from here, actually. All right, we're going into fiend territory pretty soon. That's Malcolm Holmes. You know what's crazy? While well, I had the game pause, he actually came up to me. And I'm level 26. Usually he comes like a day after or hours after you find a, a blue star cap. But for some reason he showed up rather late. I don't know why he would walk straight in the fiend territory. NTR. That takes care of that. Did you Sinking know the through the train tracks. You? Normal Fallout, New Vegas. Gek engine, whatever the heck the engine is called. Uh, creation engine. Normal behavior for it. That happens in Skyrim too, by the way. NPCs falling to the ground. Eileen out smooth and effectively. Mercenaries doing out here. You killed my brother, Motor Runner, when you whored yourself out to those NCR cunts. What? I'm gonna saw your fucking face and use your guts to grease my chains. I knew I'd find you. <laughs> Yeah, you don't know where I am, do you? What in the world is going on? Your brother's killer. What? I'm just curious to see. What mod are you from? Oh, New Vegas Bounties. Incredibly powerful perk. Go hidden immediately. I mean, like, go undetected. It's like the Skyrim uh, Ordinator perk, where if you sneak, you automatically go undetected. I can't remember what the perk was called, but I know it's in. I know it's an Ordinator. I need some more bodies. I, I'm gonna level up one more time. 
switch to a different gun if I'm going to be running around here. There you are. Well, I gotta watch it. I can discover this location. Hoping that would help me level up. You know what? We can go to Curtis Munitions and sell some stuff to get the level up. But I want to save that for when I'm about to hit a fifth level. Alright, well, I think that's going to end it for this episode here. We took out what, three or four bounties this episode. We're still alive. I don't see myself dying unless a, a fat man hits me or something at this point. Doing pretty good. I guess we'll see you back at Camp McCarran to turn this stuff in in the next episode. We'll see you then.